UAB decided to accomplish device integration through three phases, static patient, static device, static patient, mobile device, and mobile patient, mobile device. The ICU went live in May 2008. We saw a significant drop in the vital signs documentation time from four minutes to 20 seconds, a 92% gain in efficiency. The success of the project led to the expansion of this interface to 11 units, two step downs, six ICUs, and three recovery areas. This is a total of 438 devices. With this success, we knew we wanted to connect devices at the medical and surgical bedside with the static patient mobile device workflow. It was important that our solution provide accurate data that updated the patient's chart in real time with an overall workflow time savings for the clinicians. In order to do this, we needed nursing authentication and positive patient ID capabilities on the device. Initially in planning, we began the discussions around workstations on wheels, what we refer to as WOWs. Those were already on the floors, in addition to the vital sign devices. This would have allowed us to leverage the WOWs, as well as other existing infrastructure, such as the Cerner iBus and connectivity engines. This solution would have had two devices to roll from room to room. We discovered that the WOWs were beneficial for documentation, but were breaking the workflow mobility. The clinician was unable to roll both the WOW and the medical device together when moving room to room. This led us to explore other options. We worked with our Cerner partners to determine what other options were available. The concept of placing a Cerner version 3 connectivity engine and device adapter on an existing vital signs monitor to create a single device for data capture and input was born. The original designs had trouble rolling around and were top heavy, but the workflow was vastly improved. That led us to our current state of Welch Allen Connex Vital Signs devices integrated with the Cerner CareWare Vitals Link implementation. The Vital Signs Monitor, Connectivity Engine, and Device Adapter all in one. The direct integration with Cerner allowed us to configure the device to complete our desired workflow with nursing authentication, positive patient ID, and immediate posting to the patient chart. The benefit to the clinician workflow was greatly improved, as they could now use a single device to complete both the capture and documentation of vital signs. Unlike some other systems, which require hospitals to architect and develop their own system and processes, to manually connect individual devices to their EMR, the Welch Allen Connex Vital Sign Device and Cerner CareAware Vitals Link solution provides end-to-end -end connectivity. It is completely integrated and doesn't require any third-party software or external hardware or PCs to send data. The Connex VSM device is flexible in that it can connect to the server in a wide range of workflows including wireless connectivity that meets the latest 802.11 ABG wireless security standards. We were able to leverage some of our existing infrastructure, such as the ADT, patient registration in Cerner, Cerner EMR, and CareAware device connectivity. The device bidirectionally communicates directly to CareAware, sending and receiving queries that enable exchange and validation of data. This was important to use for the nursing authentication and of course, positive patient ID. After the complete vital signs are taken and the clinician has validated the results, they then send the data directly from the device to CareAware to post in the patient record. This is accomplished using Cerner Vitals Link application. The solution has allowed our staff to obtain complete and accurate vital sign values at the point of care with significant workflow, accuracy, and time improvements.